In this work, we present coordinating multi-agent navigation by learning communication. First, we show prior work we build off of. TTC Forces is a recent navigation algorithm for efficient, realistic motion. On the right, you can see the expected efficient motion. However, when TTC Forces is used in complex scenarios such as the left, its paths can be inefficient. Our algorithm, CTTC, produces paths that are coordinated and efficient in scenes where TTC forces isn't. On the right is an example of the kind of coordinated paths it produces. On the left, TTC forces is struggling to land in the same scene. Here is another example of CTTC performing better than TTC forces. Our approach requires some force-based collision avoidance algorithm for which we used TTC forces. Each agent observes spatial features of their environment and their nearest neighbor. Further, they receive communication channels from negative 1 to 1 of their nearest neighbor. We feed these features into a parameterized linear transform. Although, the spatial features are first nonlinearized to create decision boundaries and greater distinguish the communication between agents. Then, the output of this transform is clamped from negative 1 to 1 and used to create a coordination force and further communication. Central to our method is summing the new coordination force with the avoidance force from TTC forces. We set the parameters of M by repeatedly running an evaluation of the crowd's paths using this combined force, measuring the overhead over the individual optimal paths, and reiterating with a global optimizer. Note that we color the agents according to their communication values. Emerged from our method are our apparent central norms. In this example, agents communicating red weight, those communicating blue pursue their goal, and teal agents repel each other into lanes. Here we see a clumping behavior between similar color and direction agents. Again, note that CTTC is more efficient than TTC forces. Here is an example of following behavior, where blue agents tend to follow red agents, which leads to the efficient spiraling behavior. Each scenario is optimized individually, so different kinds of communication and behavior emerge per scenario. Semantics emerge from the communication channels in a decentralized manner where agents can path efficiently at multiple scales. Further propagation and communication values can emerge as seen here with the blue hue that causes downward motion. With a flash of a different hue, greeting is another communication behavior that can emerge. We train the parameters of M on one scenario, but these parameters can be applied to other scenarios, typically with efficient behavior. Here are some examples of the circle scenario generalizing. 